hello everyone you are welcome how to solve and find the value of this interesting exponential math problem let's try how can we solve it first of all here we will do some changes in this one term at raised to power 5 and at raised to power 3 so next we can write this equation as we can write at raised to power 5 as at raised to power 4 plus 1 plus at raised to power 4 will be the same plus now we will do some changes in at raised to power 3 so we can write at raised to power 3 as at raised to power 2 plus 1 plus the at raised to power 2 will be the same plus at raised to power 1 will be also the same plus at raised to power 0 is 1 now here in these two terms we will use an exponential math property so here we will use this one exponential math property at raised to power m plus n can also be written as n raised to power m times at raised to power n so using this exponential property here in these two terms this equation will become this will become is equal to at raised to power 4 times at raised to power 1 plus at raised to power 4 plus now this will become at raised to power 2 times at raised to power 1 plus at raised to power 2 plus at raised to power 1 is simply 8 plus 1. Now what we will do here in this one step? Now in this step we will take at raised to power 4 common from the first two terms and at raised to power 2 common from the third and fourth terms. So this equation will become taking at raised to power 4 common from the first two terms here at raised to power 1 is left plus here only 1 is left plus now taking at raised to power 2 common from the third and fourth term this here at raised to power 1 is left plus here only 1 is left plus a plus 1 is 9 but next this will become at raised to power 4 times now at raised to power 1 is simply 8 so 8 plus 1 is 9 plus at raised to power 2 this will become at raised to power 1 is simply 8 so 8 plus 1 is 9 plus 9 now here we will take 9 common from all the terms because there is 9 in all the terms so let us take 9 common from all terms so this will become here at raised to power 4 is left plus here at raised to power 2 is left plus here only 1 is left because we can write any number times 1 now here next we can write this at raised to power 4 as 9 times we can write at raised to power 4 as at raised to power 2 times at raised to power 2 plus at raised to power 2 plus 1 now from here we will take at raised to power 2 common from these two terms inside the parenthesis so this will become is equal to 9 times now taking at raised to power 2 common so this will become here at raised to power 2 is left plus here only 1 is left plus this one brace is close now here we substitute the value of 8 square now 8 times 8 is 64 so let us replace 8 square with 64 in both places so this will become 64 times 64 plus 1 plus 1 braces close now let us add these two numbers so this will become 9 times 64 times no, 64 plus 1 is 65 plus 1 braces close now here we need to multiply these two numbers so here we can multiply these two numbers by simple or ordinary multiplication in the work but here i will multiply these two numbers with a very tricky and simple way so let's try how can we multiply these two numbers without a rough work so this will become nine times now here we can write 64 as 60 plus 4 now we can also write 65 as 60 plus 5 plus 1 
braces close. Now here first we multiply this 60 with these two numbers, first with 60 and then with 5. And second we will multiply 4 with 60 and then with 5. So let's try how can we multiply these numbers. So 9 times 60 times 60, 60 times 60 plus this will become 60 times 5 plus we multiply 4 with these two numbers so this will become 4 times 60 plus 4 times 5 plus 1 braces close and let's multiply all these numbers inside the parenthesis so this equation will become 9 times no 60 times 60 is 60 times 0 is 0 60 times 6 is 6 times 0 is 0 6 times 6 is 36 so this will become 3600 plus no 5 times 0 is 0 5 times 6 is 30 plus 4 times 0 is 0 4 times 6 is 24 so this is 240 plus 4 times 5 is 20 plus 1 braces close now here we will add these four numbers inside the parenthesis so this will become 9 times this will become 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 is simply 0 now 2 plus 4 is 6 6 plus 0 is 6 6 plus 0 is 6 no 2 plus 3 is 5 5 plus 6 is 11 so 1 1 will be carried to this number 3 plus 1 is 4 so the sum of these four numbers gives him 4160 plus this one braces close now let us add these two numbers so this will become 9 times now this will become 416 0 plus 1 is 1 so the sum of these two numbers gives him 4161. Now finally and in last we will multiply these two numbers. So there are two different ways to multiply these two numbers. One is to directly multiply this 9 with this number in the rough work or directly here. And the second method is we can also write this 9 as 10 minus 1 times this one number 4161. Now here this is also a very simple method because we can multiply this number with 10 easily which gives him 41,610 minus we can also multiply this number with 1 which is which gives him this one number and then we will subtract the dead two numbers. So here we will try to multiply these numbers using this one method simple method by multiplication. So here we will multiply 9 with this number so we will start from the 1's position. So 9 times 1 is 9 9 times 6 is 54 so 4 5 will be carried 9 times 1 is 9 9 plus 5 is 14 so again 4 1 will be carried 9 times 4 is 36 36 plus 1 is 37 so the product of these two numbers gives him 37,449 so finally this is our answer and value of this interesting simplification math problem now in last if you like this video so don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel thanks for watching